Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Good morning, my dear friends in Christ. We begin this Sunday reflection in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today is another day of worship, and we thank God for being alive in the land of the living. Thank you, Jesus. It is also the 19th Sunday in ordinary time ye be. Our reading today is from the Gospel of John chapter 6. From verse 41 to 51, and our topic is titled, Jesus, the Bread of Life. Jesus, the Bread of Life. In our sharing of last week, we saw that our Lord Jesus Christ is our satisfier, and he satisfies all our needs, whether they are spiritual or physical. The Master declared that he is the bread that came down from heaven. This made the Jews uncomfortable. How can the son of Joseph, the carpenter, claim to come down from heaven? They asked among themselves. But our Lord declared to them that he is not just the bread that came down from heaven. He is the bread of life. Bread is food. But it is physical food for the human body. Christ therefore presents himself as the person who is the bread of life, that he is the food that satisfies, but above all, the food that leads to eternal life. In order to have life in this world and live in the world to come forever, we must eat the Lord Jesus Christ. It means we must take in his words and his teachings. We must be filled with the word of God to lead us to an eternity with God. I ask you now, are you hungry for the bread that gives eternal life? Do you want to take in Jesus so that you can live with God forever in heaven? If your answer to all these questions is yes, then come to Jesus. Receive his words and teachings and live by them day by day. May you receive grace to live by the words of Jesus and make heaven through Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I pray that this week will be a fruitful week for us in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray that the bread of life will be there to speak for us and strengthen us through Christ our Lord. Amen and amen. Happy Sunday and have a fruitful week ahead. You are highly blessed. Amen. Thank you, Jesus.